Hey, what's up guys? It's Fantastic Films here today. We are going Blu-ray hunting. I am super excited. We are going to two places today. We're going to go to Best Buy first, and then we're going to go to a pawn shop, which is right near it. I've been to this pawn shop once before, and they had some really great deals. We're going to go to Best Buy first because I already know what they have pretty much, but I want to see if they have anything else. I love steelbooks, and I'm going through like a huge steelbook phase right now. So if they have a bunch of $10 steelbooks, I really want to jump on that, but at the same time, I want to see what they have at the pawn shop because it was like $5 for a Blu-ray or something like that and they offer like special deals too so anyway uh, we're gonna go to Best Buy first and if I can't find anything at pawn shop we'll go back to Best Buy so I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's head out to Best Buy Alright guys, so we just arrived at Best Buy, let's go inside and see what they got. Alright guys, we got out of Best Buy, uh, I didn't get much footage in there, I'm sorry, it seemed like the power was out, I don't know if you can tell, but all the lights were out, and they only had like a few in the back, so everything looked super grainy, so that's really unfortunate, but you know what, um, it's alright, I found some things I think I'm going to get, I found, well, I won't spoil it, I'll save it for the end of the video, uh, we're gonna head off to the pawn shop, and, um, if I do end up getting what I think I'm gonna get, at Best Buy. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get it, but if I do, um, I'm not going to film it. I'm just going to, you know, show you guys what I got in the car. So anyway, let's head off to the pawn shop. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'll get what I hit at Best Buy, but if we don't, you never know. So uh, let's go to the pawn shop and see what we find. All right, guys, we're at the pawn shop. Let's go inside and see what they got. So I actually finished at the pawn shop and I went to Best Buy, I didn't get any footage, but I did buy the items that I hid, so I'm going to show them to you right now, and it's going to be an unboxing video, so that's exciting, I always, I'm always too impatient to uh, open them up on camera and wait. What actually ended up happening is I bought them at a Best Buy and I walked out, I got in the car and I drove away, I forgot. So we are currently at a uh, Rite Aid parking lot, that's why there's a brick wall behind me. So I wanted to get in a parking lot where I could show you guys what I got, so without further ado, let's do it. And this is my special unboxing knife. Uh, I don't do many unboxings, but whenever I open up a Blu-ray, uh, every single Blu-ray I've opened, I always open with this knife. So the first item I picked up was the uh, Complete Mission Impossible Collection. I already own 4 and 5, but I really wanted to get 1 and 2, and well, 1 and 3 I should say. Uh, 2 is okay, but if I were to get them separately, the first 3, uh, it would be around 30 bucks, because it's 10 bucks a Blu-ray, and this was only 20 bucks. It was a really cheap set, so I'm super glad I picked this up. Now, let's get the unboxing going. There we go. Just gotta pull this off like that. Alright, so it comes with a slip cover, slip case like that. That's cool. Oh, there's uh, the back of the slip cover if you want it. Then you got Tom Cruise from Rogue Nation, which is actually 
I know this isn't a popular opinion, but it's actually my fourth favorite of all of them. Uh, my favorites go one, three, four, five, and two. I hate two. I only I've only seen two like twice, and I can't watch it anymore. Than that. All right. So basically, you get the front. There's your spine and the back with all like info, and then okay, I see. This is this is pretty cool. All right. So. Uh, I'm not going to take the discs out, but there is disc art, or there is uh, artwork behind the discs. Alright, so here's what you got. You got your, uh, you got Tom Cruise there. And you got uh, Mission Impossible 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And there is artwork behind them. Maybe I'll show it to you in a later unboxing, but I don't want to take all the discs out and risk something falling and getting scratched. So, there is your uh, Mission Impossible set. And it did come with a, a code, digital code, and since I don't use those, and I love you guys, if, if you want the codes for Mission Impossible 1, 2, and 3, well, uh, there you go. See? 1, 2, and 3. Alright, you got that. And then these work with iTunes too. And four and five, so there's the top, and there is the codes. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Um, I never use them, really isn't much of a sacrifice for me, but I know that a lot of you guys love them, so I hope you enjoy it. Alright, so the second movie I picked up, I was really excited to see, I missed it, it got a ton of Oscar nominations, and my friend finally got it, uh, Chris video. he picked it up, so I was like, okay, enough said, I'm buying it. So, I got the Whiplash Steelbook. Uh, this movie looks amazing, J.K. Simmons, and like, uh, Miles Teller, I mean, this movie looks just incredible. Now, let's see, here's the care, you gotta be careful here. Because I have done this before of steelbooks when I'm opening them up and I've accidentally ended up scratching like the inside part there. So I have to be like super careful. But as long as you're careful, you're good. Alright. So this is an amazing steelbook, by the way. Like I'm so amazed by how beautiful this is. Alright. So there's your front and your spine. And this does come with a J card, so you take off the J card carefully. I do save the J cards because uh, it has all the information on them. So it's also like a collectible thing, but whatever. So uh, there's your J card. It's pretty nice. The flash. <laughs> okay, this is amazing. So uh, you have your steel book. And when you open it up and hold it like this, look at that. That, that is beautiful. That's incredible. I am so, so glad I waited to pick up the Steelbook instead of buying the regular Blu-ray. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, this movie looks amazing. There's your disc. And there is a code. I'll show it to you in a minute. Um, I can take out the disc for this one. The inside isn't quite as thrilling, but it's still cool. Uh, you got your drum set, and there is blood splatter here, and on the front there. And I did promise you guys the code, so there it is for Whiplash. Uh, I don't know if this one is compatible with uh, iTunes or not, but there is your code. I hope you guys enjoy that. Um, I really don't use them. Isn't that disgusting? Like, that's the stuff that, uh, you know that sticky stuff? It's like a gel. Kinda looks like a booger. It's the stuff that uh, keeps the steel book and the J card connected together. I hate this stuff. It's like, get that away from me. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I'm super happy with my pickups. So, here they are, just one last time. I am in love right now. Um, Blade Runner 2049 is still my favorite, second favorite steel book. My first is Casino Royale. But anyway, guys, thank you so so much for watching if you liked this video make sure to give it a like if you had any comments questions advice ideas leave it in the comment section down below i always get back to you guys make sure to let me know if you've seen whiplash i've seen uh, all the mission impossibles but i haven't seen whiplash let me know if you've seen it and guys as always thank you so so much for watching make sure to subscribe that way i can see you guys soon peace